Pro-Pack fill cans uh, made by Proform here in Milton, Ontario, Canada. Just want to give you a little demo. That's the kind of fan we get. We also have a two inch fan on here and this is available on all of our paint cans and primer cans. And we have a little two inch fan spray. And the reason I gave you that little demo is that's our Pro-Pack filling aerosol. Uh, a lot of jobbers or distributors are using that to uh, put uh, put formulations of paint in there and then they sell a factory, uh, a factory formula uh, from any of the paint lines. And then the uh, customer can uh, do the painting and it matches the, the paint color. Really what I want to talk to you today is about when you fill these cans, is these, this is one of the heads that's used uh, in the filling process. And you'll recognize this if you're using it. And inside of there is a little ball. And that little ball seals this, seals it so that what happens is that we depress, we depress the paint and press the little ball down and fills the paint into the aerosol can. And so one of the tests is, uh, if you're not getting, uh, if it's not filling properly or leaking, you'll get, you'll, 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 you will hear gurgling when you do this little test. So I'm basically going to show you how to rebuild this. We have a seal kit right here, and in the seal kit, you got a little ball, a little seal. That ball goes up into that seal inside of here. You got a spring and a little O-ring, and I'll show you where all these are located if you've never seen inside of the head. So basically you take this little tool here, you put it in, loosen the threads out, and I like to pull that out. And that black seal is right there. Inside of here is the ball, the spring, and the and the white seal. And that seal goes up against that seal inside of there and that does that. The easiest way to do that is you can replace all these parts with those, but these parts I have here are fine. This is a brand new head. But uh, I'll just show you. You put the spring in there like that. I like to stick it on the tool like this. And don't drop it. And then it goes on there like that. And the easiest way to do that is stick the head back on top like this. And then flip it over. And at the same time, screw it in. Okay. You'll see that it's perfectly sealed in there. Now, the true test is this, after you've cleaned it or replaced these parts, put it back on a, on a, a can that doesn't have any paint or anything, just a solvent or propellant. Hold your hand over like this, you don't hear any gurgling, and there's no solvent leaking out, and you've got a perfect seal and a perfectly rebuilt head. Thank you for your business, we really appreciate it.